Hi, Grandma Mary here. And I've talked a little bit in the past about adding an RSS feed to your fan page or to your profile. And mostly I've been talking about adding the RSS feed from a blog. But there is an application in Facebook where you can add an RSS feed from, from anywhere, any kind of feed that you want to post automatically to your wall. So I would be a little bit cautious, a little bit, a little bit, uh, a little bit concerned about this. Don't, don't start feeding in a whole bunch of stuff. You don't know, have any control over it. You make sure you know where the feed's coming from, what kind of feed it is. Um, but you can do it. So here's how you do it: is if you just go ahead and search on the application in Facebook, RSS Graffiti. Just search on it and you'll get to this application page and so what you want to do from here if you go to the application it takes you into more information there this is kind of a Facebook page within there but if you want to go ahead and just add it to your page you click on this and say add it to your page and then you pick which page you want it to add it to um, and from there You'll go into the back end, say you're going into, um, so say I'm going into Grandma Mary, and you would go into the back end of your fan page in the edit page area, and then from there you can edit the, edit the, the settings here, and here's where it'll take you. It'll take you to something like this. And actually, I have the feed here for Pastrami, a delicious sandwich, which is a fan page I, I monitor and, and administer there because I love pastrami. And so what you do here is you can just go ahead and add a feed here. So you just add the feed and type it in, and you get to add the feed URL, and you'll get the preview and all kinds of stuff there and you can set the style and all kinds of stuff like that and, um, and save it. Now, um, you can also set the times on how often you want it to post, if you want it to, you know, do a once a day kind of thing, whatever it is. So you can control the settings a little bit so you're not over posting. Uh, and it's a handy thing to have you want to be careful. I've seen a few things where people have trouble. It all of a sudden starts posting it, even though you, they've switched this little thing to off. It keeps posting. And if that happens to you, you can always remove the whole application and block it. I mean, block it, whatever you want to do from it. But stop the whole, remove the application from having access to your account. Because once, you, uh, once you start going down the path, it'll ask you if you want to allow the access. And so, Yes, you want to allow it, but if it gets out of control on you, if it goes crazy and haywire, here's what you do is you go to account and the application settings, and this can be true for any application you've got. You can go ahead and go to the, the RSS graffiti setting and just totally delete it from your whole profile, so it'll totally stop it in its tracks. So I just want to want you to be aware of that and how you remove applications as well. So there you go, RSS Graffiti, good way to get some information into your fan page, into your profile, some RSS feeds if you need to, and that's how you, you set the settings up. So hope that was helpful. Talk to you next time.